I live in Long Beach. We have a pyramid that's pretty fucking sick. There's also a dope ass bridge and a lit as fuck bay. Oh yeah, beaches on beaches on fucking sick ass beaches, hence the beach. Being so close, I go up to LA City now and again and I've had some good times there. And that's the only city I've been to. But it doesn't really feel like I'm passing through the hustle and bustle of a city, like I can turn a corner and have my life changed. It feels a little broken, spread out, kind of lazy almost, like all the fun shit is happening behind a door and you have to know a guy to get in. I'm waiting for that moment where I just bump into excitement. I mean, it happens to Casey all the time, and he lives in a city. Don't get me wrong, there's lots to do for a college kid that just turned 21 in Long Beach. It's nice. But let's just say, walking to the party is out of the question. I've always wanted to be in a big city. It's just that I'm tethered to this place, so I stay close by. And I'm a year out from getting that crest of achievement for a degree that will help me 0%. One day, I would think. One day. And then, out of the fucking blue, like the unprecedented success of D-Trump, like the step that you didn't see, like the fucking M. Night Shyamalan you used to love, I get a text. Reunion in San Fran? Friends have fallen on hard times, and we need to light up a trip. These people right here are my good old friends. This is Madison. What is happening right now? Hello? No. Sex Wait, why? <laughs> this is Sophila. I don't do this normally. You're filming this? Oh my god, how are you feeling this right now? Well, maybe you just hurry up and untie your shoes. This is not my real life. Sophila has lived here for a couple of years, so she took us on a grand tour. <laughs> Golden Gate Bridge. We are going to go to Chinatown. I saw a really dope pyramid, a fucking sick as shit bridge, and a fucking lit bay. The people were great. The food was great. It's like everyone was so invested in their city. It was about an event or an opening or a change or a closing. The conversation was all about the city and the people reveled in it. In the middle of all the excitement, I asked myself a lot of questions. Is it the people? Is it me? Why do I crave this rhythm so much? There is no geographical solution to an emotional problem, Mary. Tony Soprano. Maybe not, Tony. But what if I'm not running away from any problems, huh? What if I got a geographical problem? I've been in Long Beach for three years and I'm still struggling to find its pulse. Fuck, I don't know what it is. I don't know. Either way, I know the city feels good. 